Hello everyone, welcome to another installment of Museum Monday. Today, we're commemorating Women's History Month. March is Women's History Month, and we have an amazing assortment of objects in our collection that offer a window to the past. And here, we're gonna talk about one of the most famous individuals, one of the most famous civilians associated with the Battle of Gettysburg. But Wayne, what do we have here? Chris, these images, I think, you know, portray some of, some of the most common told stories here in the Battle of Gettysburg, or maybe the most commonly told story, and that's the story of 20-year-old Mary Virginia Wade. Mary Virginia Wade was a local citizen here at Gettysburg. She was at her sister's home caring for her sister and her sister's new child when she was shot and killed by a sharpshooter's bullet on July 3rd, 1863. The photograph that's at the top here in the display case is uh, a photograph of Mary Virginia Wade, her sister Georgia Wade McClellan, and a family friend of theirs, and it's an 1861 image. It's the original, only one, cased image. And then at the bottom is a photograph of her boyfriend, some people say fiance, although we don't know that for certain, of Johnston Skelly, who was a member of the 87th Pennsylvania Infantry Regiment, who was mortally wounded at the Battle of Winchester in June of 1863. And this image was in Mary Virginia Wade's apron when she was shot and killed by the sharpshooter at the Battle of Gettysburg. She's buried here in our Evergreen Cemetery. So this is currently on display in our temporary exhibit, A Rough Course Life, The World of the Civil War Soldier, one of the thousands of objects we have on display here at the Gettysburg Museum and Visitor Center. Uh, we hope to catch you on our next installment of Museum Monday, and we hope to see you sometime in the building here on the Gettysburg Battlefield. So thanks for watching. Thanks.